What's up guys, welcome back to another video. So this video guys is gonna be based off of a poll that I put out a few months ago. And the number one thing that was voted on was a weapon reveal. Which I'm actually shocked guys because this weapon reveal didn't get a ton of views, but it got the most comments. So without further ado, let's see what I picked out. Okay guys, so after opening the box, this is a Winchester Wildcat. So this takes 22 long rifle shells guys, this is not a mag. So the cylinder that comes with this guys, it's a cylinder, it's legit a cylinder guys, it's not a clip. You could call it a clip, but it's a cylinder. You just take it, push it straight in, and you're locked and loaded. There's no ammo in it, totally empty. But it, it works okay guys, holds a few rounds. Um, the cool thing about this gun, guys, is there is, right here, you can pull, ejects, not that bad. Um, there's that way you can eject it, guys, or there's this little red tab right here, pull it, shoots it out. So, I used this for a little bit, and I was like, it's okay. Um, after a while, I was like, you know what, you might want to upgrade. So I was like, yeah, I want to upgrade a little bit, guys. Went and upgraded to a Ruger BX25 clip. So obviously this holds 25 rounds. I have pushed it to 26, I do not recommend it guys. So all in all your gun can hold 27 rounds with this clip. Insert it, looks pretty cool. So like I said, same way, pull right here, pull right here. It's not all that hard. Simple clip, there is shells in this one but I did not do the chamber. So then I have my trusty Buckmaster scope put onto it. You can turn the knob and it gives you certain zooms. So you have from three times zoom all the way to eight, which you can also go to a max. And there's caps on this. Uh, you can adjust your sight when you're shooting it. And then also guys, this has a threaded barrel. Make sure if you're wanting to buy this and you want a threaded barrel for possibly a silencer, which you have to go through the government to get, and get a permit, you'll make sure it's a threaded barrel, guys. Um, it's also, you can put a muffler on it, but it unscrews very simply. Just like that, it's not that hard. This gun is crazy accurate, guys. Um, Let's do something that I haven't done before. Let's go out and try it. All right guys, so we're out to one of my outback trails and I set a target, as you can see right there. That little white object, that's a little plate with a black dot. So I'm going to take out the cylinder clip and put in the big 25 clip. Has shells in it guys, like I said previously. It's in. I'm going to set this aside. All right, now since I set that aside, I'm going to pop the caps on this. And I'll be able to see right. And then I brought my trusty earplugs, guys. I recommend earplugs. Your ears will ring on certain guns. This gun, not so much, but other guns with a higher caliber will definitely make your ears ring, guys. So after putting the earplugs in, I can't hear hardly anything. Now I'm going to pull it in the chamber. Make sure that safety is off now because I'm ready to fire the barrel in the air. Now, let's see how good of a shot I am. Alright guys, so after firing that shot, I'm going to put it on safety, remove my earplugs, put them back in my pocket, and we can go see how good of a shot I am. Alright guys, so as you can see, I was aiming dead center and it went a little high and to the left. So that's not horrible, but that is definitely a killer shot. If you're hunting wildlife guys or if you're just straight target practicing that is not a bad shot 
All right, guys, so I'm gonna put my earplugs back in for my hearing safety. So with my earplugs in, I will begin to fire and I'm just gonna shoot it like crazy, guys. Moving safety, like I said. Gun in the air. Well, the plate disappeared, guys. That's a good sign. That means I hit it. Still got a lot of rounds in there, but guys, let's take it back to the office. All right, guys. So after going and trying out the Wildcat Winchester, it's a pretty good gun. You guys uh, can comment in the comment section what you think about it. Uh, it's not an expensive gun at all. Winchester made these extremely affordable, guys. Um, it's not. It's not that much. Um, I'm wearing a Winchester shirt, I'm not being sponsored by Winchester or YouTube concerns. Um, but guys, the people who let me borrow this gun and advertise it for them was Black Lantern Outdoors from Bethany, Missouri. Great guys, I recommend going and checking them out. They're not paying me to say this guys, um, but great people, they let me borrow this, like I said, to do this video. Um, but without further ado, thank you for watching guys. Please like, subscribe, and share these. Share these videos, guys. Um, I'm wanting to bump up the views and the subscribers. I'm wanting to make this more, slightly more than a hobby, guys. Um, that's what I'm wanting to do. Uh, if you guys want more of these videos, please, I mean, please, comment. Um, I do any kind of video you want. If you want a certain kind of video, just, but in the comment section, I'll consider it. Thank you for watching, as I said, and goodbye.